Hey guys, let's talk about this card. It started at 40 cents and now it is $4.61, a rise of over a thousand percent. Typically, you almost never see bulk rise up in price like that. But this piece is a very, very fun card to play in combo. It typically gets 26 26. You can pump it, you can re pump it, you can pump it multiple times exponentially actually increasing its power and toughness now it is also one of the best cards to play in limited and i've been beat with this in draft uh, when the opponent gets enough energy they just run it over you so let's read what that does free for a 1-1 when it enters battlefield you get free energy counters you can pay the free energy counters and it gets plus x plus x where x is its power now, if you have a ton of energy counters and a ton of ways to make energy counters, you can make this thing huge. Now, add a little bit of trample and you get a, you know, one of the most fun ways to win the game is with a giant big creature, especially a creature that used to be small is now huge. And then it just tramples over your opponent, winning you the game. So definitely I can understand why this card is very popular. I'm a little taken back by all these budget builds and um, cards that were used to be budget spiking so hard i don't really see that as a positive when someone says oh i'm gonna make a budget deck and then the next day the budget deck is increased by 10 times what it was the day previous now theoretically it should reduce the prices of other cards in the set otherwise the store owners would open as many of these as possible therefore repopulating you know the stock again but i haven't seen that yet overall a very fun card probably the most fun card in kaladesh anyway bye guys